Hi, Entertaining Universe. So I had to do something yesterday that I hadn't done in quite some time. You can probably already guess by the, the way I look up here. I had to because it was the it was just getting too long and it was just it was just driving me it start, it was starting to drive me crazy a little bit how long my hair was getting on the top of my head because you know I had been growing out my hair for quite some time and it was getting very very long don't get me wrong I and it just it was just getting it was just getting to be too much for me so I had to do that. Now there's still a lot of a lot of work or a lot of things that need to be done in order to make myself look good again. It's mostly in my stomach area, and and in my lip, my I've got way too much chopped lips. But the fact is that you know I know what I said the other day that appearance isn't everything. But sometimes when you get when you have long hair or you have chopped lips or you know, your stomach's starting to grow because you're eating way too much food. It it's just it can be a little bit taxing on someone's life. And I needed to make a change in my life. Now I'm not saying I'm gonna be getting any new wardrobe anytime soon because that's not what I'm saying at all. That's the complete opposite of what I'm saying. You know, maybe I'll get a few new clothes here and there, like new shorts and new shirts and you know, maybe new sweatshirts and jackets and things of that nature at some point in my life. But right now, the wardrobe's going to stay the same for a while. It's just maybe, you know, getting more haircuts now that, you know, that spring is almost sprung. It's not quite here yet, but it's getting closer and closer and closer to being here. And I need to make a few changes in my life. And those changes consist of me looking better than I should, than I, than I have been in the past. And the first step towards that was getting my hair cut. Because it was just, just too much for me to handle all that hair that I had on my head. And the next step is, you know, is trying to figure out how to, you know, look to get rid of some of this weight. And then maybe, you know, I'm not saying I'm ever going to get rid of my glasses. I love my glasses. And I always will love wearing glasses. But maybe someday I'll get with the glass surgery. Maybe someday. I don't know. Maybe someday I'll fix my nose. Even though I love the shape of my nose and how it is. And, you know, maybe I won't have as chapped lips as I do currently. I mean, I've had chapped lips for a long time. But the point is that, you know, I want to change a few things in my appearance to make me look better and I know it's going to take time to get all of the all of my ducks lined in a row of looking better than I have been in the past and I'm going to try my best to you know maybe lose a few pounds here and there you know make you know make small changes of my appearance not not huge changes just small little minuscule ch changes uh, in my life. And that's what's important to me cur currently. And that's what's going to be important to me for the long run is that, you know, I, I, take a, I take the next step in, you know, making me better for me before I can make it better for someone else. And the first, like I said, the first step was, for me it was to get a haircut because I hadn't gotten a haircut in a long time and I needed to get one. And then the next step is, you know, is not eating as much crappy foods. But that may take a little longer than, you know, how long it took me to get a haircut. And the same thing with my, my lips or my nose or my eyes or whatever it may be. It's going to be a process, let's just put it that way. And I'm ready for this process. So, you know... I don't know how you're going to take this or if you're going to take this at, well at all, but I'm just saying for me, it it's time that I maybe, like I said, maybe I'll change my wardrobe into something better. I'm not saying I'm going to, you know, wear dress shirts all the time or wear, 
dress shorts or dress pants or pants or jeans all the time. I'm just going to, you know, change up my style just a tiny bit. Not too big, not too small, just a tiny bit. Or just a little bit. Anyways, I think that's where, you know, things are... I, I did, I do want to talk about something I got in the mail yesterday. It's a movie. And I've ordered a couple movies on Amazon and such. Like the next, I've got 13. What were some of the other ones? Uh, Beastly. And there's a few other movies that I got on Amazon that I'm looking forward to getting. Uh, Scrib the Scribbler. Uh, and then I've also got a book coming. And there's just a bunch of other stuff that... Uh, the book is Ready Player Two by Ernest Klein, and a few more movies that I f can't remember exactly what they are, but they're supposed to be coming in the next, you know, couple weeks or so. And the movie I got yesterday is called Relentless. It's got Lauren Shaw, and it's got, uh, Sydney Sweeney, and it's got a bunch of other actors and actresses you may or may not have heard of. But, that's just... That's just, I watched, I watched it last night, and I also watched A uh, Little Women again, so, and I watched Doolittle again, so, I mean, I've been watching a lot of movies, and I've been getting closer and closer to finishing this uh, book that I currently have. I'm, like, less than 100 pages away. I think I'm, like, 40-something pages away, no, 50, maybe 60 pages away for finishing The Battle of Songbirds and Saints, so there's that. Uh, with that being said... You guys keep it all real. Oh, wait. I want to wish Kayvon Looney and Crystal Marie Reed happy birthday. Kayvon is 25 and Crystal is, is 36 today. Anyone else who has a birthday? Or, yeah, I guess I'll do it today. Anyone else who has a birthday on this sixth day of February 2021? Happy birthday to you. And. You be the best version of yourselves you could possibly be, and you do you. So anyone else tell you how to do you? And I will see you tomorrow with the brand spanking new vlog, and ciao.